guys, most of y'all do not know me, but my name is Chloe Darby, and I like to draw, and I'm also called the, the queen of random. So, I like to draw, and right now I have some paper, and I'm going to be showing you how I draw. Also, I'm going to show you a little bit of my artwork at this time. So, I have this one right here. That is my one of mine. I have this one. And that is braces also. These are the I love my eyes and this is one of my artwork too. I also have one right here. I like her. She's pretty okay. And I tried doing my eye one day, but I don't think it came out right. I also have this one of different eyes. Don't mind this up at the top. That was me practicing. This is the different eyes. I also have this one, which I truly adore. But I forgot to do the other eyebrow, so no judge. Um, I also did this. She's a kind of older lady, but this is her with the slick down hair. And she also has love on her. It's kind of backwards, but it says love. And I also that, and I also have these mini drawings. Uh, so, so this is my first one. I love her. She's pretty cute. I have her. I like her. I like her. Yes, I chose to write that new. I like her. And I also like her. And I'm also going to go get one more sheet of paper. Be right back. I just want to go get another sheet of paper. And this is it. This is someone with deep cheeks, cute, fluffy hair, um, bun, uh, the fade effect with the hair. I did this one for these two also. These. And also this is um a slightly older woman because she has black and gray hair. So and I also signed it. And I also have the date that I done it in it. Also at the top, um I hate that my art is just backwards but it say faces at the top. And that's basically all of my artwork and I'm gonna put all this in the folder and I'm gonna be showing y'all how to draw an eye because most of y'all needs help and some of y'all want help so you know you look help. I'm gonna be doing on this paper that you can also look at while I'm doing it. And these are my other mini drawings that I'm about to put up. So, I have multiple materials, but I have one a pencil, a kind of broken pencil because it was broke. And I also like how it makes you grip the pencil. So, I'm going to be starting. So, let's get right into the video. So, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make multiple eyes. So, first what you want to do is start out with an oval. So, make sure you have the oval. Like the size of anyone's eye that you try to draw, or just a eye in general. So first thing you do is draw it, and I want to be drawing. Okay, so here goes the eye right here, and what you want to do is make a circle inside the eye. Okay, there you go. Here goes it right here. And now you want to draw the pupil inside the eye and also the light. There you go. So here goes one right here. 
Now you want to draw the top of the eyebrow. And this is the eye. And also, now what you want to do is draw your shading. So you want to start from light to dark. No, you want to start to dark to light. So you want to make the top of the eye dark and start going into a lighter color, which is called value. So you want to use a value technique to do that also. So, yeah. So I'm going to do that right now. And... Right now, just shading. You can do it in blotches, like if I write 10 rules, that helps you. But now you have this eye right here. That is as realistic as it can get, but what am I missing? Huh? What am I missing? I'm missing eyelashes, because most of people have eyelashes. But most people don't have one. Well, also, before we do the eyelashes, you want to add this little part of your eye in there, which will help it be more realistic as it can be. And I also have this patch of different uh, pencils, markers, pens, like, and other uh, art tools. So, I just erase this because sometimes it helps you to do the regular eye. I just erase that part. And you want to draw like the little curve of it, like a, a C, a backward C. So then you do that right there. And then you want to kind of draw a line to close the eye. There you go. There you go. See that? And now what you want to do is add your eyelashes. You want to draw them going upwards. So you want to kind of go right here and go up with it. If you can see that. It's not really light. It's not really showing up. But you want to kind of go up with it all the way down. And at the end, you want to kind of go it down a little bit. And I'll show you how to do more stuff to add to the eye to make it more realistic. You want to do that at the top, but also at the bottom. And you want to kind of make the eye, the eyelashes quite full. But not all the way through. So then you have the eyelashes. Now you want to add the bottom eyelash. And you want to kind of do that shape like if it's like a, a curved a upside down L flip. So turn the L upside down and then flip it. And then that's what you'll get for what I'm trying to do. And there goes your eye. And now you want to add this part of your eye. So it's just a basically a, a stretch C. Because if you want it to curve. So there it is right there. And now if you want to add an eye point, like mascara or whatever, I'm going to show you how to do that in one second. So first what you want to do is kind of have it going off the eye-ish. Like going out there. So then I just go out there. I'm just kind of going around the eye to give that dark effect all the way around. That is right there. And that's how you draw eyes. Make sure to tune in for more videos. Bye, you guys.